Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to Brick Eats in this video. Arby's Fish and Cheddar Review. Brick Eats. This is the new one that he uploaded today, and I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize, and I will take care of them. Now let's get to this video. You've heard of the Arby's Beef and Cheddar, but have you heard of the Arby's Fish and Cheddar? That's right, well, I got them. Yeah. It's two for $7 for a limited time, and I had to try this Fish and Cheddar because I've never had it. Oh. Welcome back to Brick Youth. I'm your host, Brian Brickman, and that's right, baby, back at Arby's. I feel like I'm at Arby's every week, always eating at Arby's. I don't know why, uh. but I, I, they constantly have new menu items. So, we're going to get after this right now. Now, I love a Beef and Cheddar. It's one of my favorite sandwiches in the world. It's got the beef, it's got the cheddar, and what you do, see, they already put Arby's sauce on it. It comes with Arby's sauce. It's a weird deal. Arby. None of the other sandwiches come with Arby's sauce. Wow. Mm. Mm. And the onion bun. Mm -mm. That is a classic Arby's sandwich right there. Now, so say you want a beef and cheddar, right? But it's Friday, and it's Lent, and you're Catholic. You can't have beef, but you can have a fish and cheddar. Look at this. Oh, look at this. Oh, lettuce just hanging everywhere. It's just drooping off like it's... I don't know what's going on here. Uh, but it is cheddar, fish, crispy fish, and it looks like tartar and uh, lettuce. Let's try this. You know, I gotta tell you, I'm kind of impressed. This is actually really good. The fish is good, it's crispy, flaky. Sorry for mumbling to myself. Sorry about that, everybody. My bad. For fast food fish. Mm, nothing wrong with that. You know what it tastes like? It tastes like the fish sticks that you get at the store and you make in your toaster oven. And those are good. Well, there you have it. I think I'll stick to my regular beef and cheddar. Because uh, I'm more of a beef and cheddar kind of guy. But if you have to get a fish, for whatever reason, or not, look at the lettuce. It's just falling everywhere. It's like, yeah. it's like raining lettuce in my truck. Wow, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So if you got to get a fish, this one's not bad at all. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. I appreciate you, and I appreciate Arby's coming out with new food literally on a weekly basis. Hey, hit that next video. I don't know which side it's on. This side. Uh, hit that next video if you want to watch the next one. And until next time, keep trying all the Arby's new menu items, including this fish and cheddar that's actually pretty good. We'll see you. Awesome video. I give it a thumbs up. And I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my channel or to Brick Eats channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know when we both post. And share both of our videos with your friends. And family members too, please everybody. And on my channel, we are on the road to 9,000 subscribers. And please help me bring my views and watch hours up on my channel by taking a look at my other videos that are on the two playlists that are on my channel. And give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please everybody. Yes, I would really appreciate it. And please help me bring my subscriber count up on my channel as well. Also, please everybody, I would really appreciate that too. And sorry for mumbling to myself again. Sorry about that everybody, my bad. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya.